Hey guys, Richard here. So welcome to how I made $1,000 in 48 hours. Now this is part four of five videos in this series. Now if you haven't seen the others, go back to part one. And what I'm explaining here is how I go about and do a promotion pretty much from start to finish and explain you step by step all of the different components in that promotion. So today I'm going to talk to you about the hype pages and give you a few examples of hype pages that I've done for promotions so you can see the kind of thinking behind them and how you can go ahead and put one together. So guys, let me just talk to you about the playlist itself. Part one was all about the promotion, how I ended up actually making $1,000 and the product that I was actually going ahead and promoting. Part two is about writing the emails and I showed you step by step how I go about and write my emails and the kind of thinking that goes into them. Part three was around building the automation, so it's slightly more technical. I show you how I go into my ultrasound and actually build an automation that's really, really impactful. Today's about making the hype pages and the actual video itself. And then part five will be a promotion review where I'll go through everything end to end and give you a few tips and tricks. So if you decide to do this yourself, you'll have a lot of success. So guys, if you haven't been over to my channel before, my name is Richard Darby. This is the School of Nomads. If you're interested in learning how to build a business online, go ahead and hit subscribe and notification bell. And I'll let you know whenever I release new videos. And guys, I have some free training. You'll see in the link in the description below. If you are interested, go ahead and grab that free training. And it's going to take you through how I built my my business step by step. So let's just have a recap of the funnel. Now this is the video that I want to show you today about how I go ahead and produce this page which is the hype video page. Now what this actually is is it's actually promoting a course called the advanced traffic blueprint which is a course that shows you how to build a business online. Now what I'm doing in this promotion is I'm actually getting people to register for a webinar where Philip Barrowman actually gives them all of the information on the actual product itself and then people can go ahead and join if this is something they want to do. So what I was doing is I actually had a hype video here where I go ahead and talk about the actual product and the webinar and explain to people exactly what this is. So in the last video I showed you how I set up this automation here that allows me to send out emails and then also send out follow-up emails if folks don't go ahead and open the original email, which you'll get quite a lot because obviously people are busy and they miss emails. So you make sure you follow up with them on a regular basis before the actual webinar starts. Now this is the automation I showed you. And today I want to show you the hype video. Now the aim of the hype video is that it actually links to a registration page. And once they go to the registration page, they'll go over to the webinar once the webinar starts. So it's pretty simple, but you know, this is very, very effective. Now, with this, I actually had an existing list of people that I was sending these emails out to. And this list, at the end of the day, comes from YouTube because I do a lot of my marketing on YouTube. And this is where folks come across my videos and then join my lists. And then they get sent promotions as and when I find products that I think will be useful to them. Now, the Advanced Traffic Blueprint is an amazing product. It's something that I have been through myself, so I know that it works. So I'm pretty confident that once folks actually go ahead and register for the webinar, if they do purchase, they are getting good quality. So let me show you one of these emails just to show you how it links to this hype video. So this is one of those emails that you saw that I send out. Now you see how super simple this email is. At the end of the day, I'm sending out one email a day for around about five days plus resends, and it's just getting people warmed up to the idea of going to a webinar and giving them a little bit of information each day just so there's not too much information in the same email. So this is the hype page that those folks were actually sent to when they clicked on the link in my email. And you see here, it's a pretty simple hype page. All I've done here really is give them the overall details of the webinar, as you see here, and just the video. And then really, I want the video to do the work for me. I want this to be able to explain to them exactly what the product is and have more information in this very, very short video. So I'll just show you a little bit of this video to show you the kind of information that I actually had on it. Hey guys, Richard here. So first of all, thank you very much for taking time to watch this video. Now, I want to personally invite you to a workshop that my mentor, Philip Barrowman, is holding on Monday, the 20th of July at 4 p.m. Eastern. Now, 
So as you see, that was a pretty simple video, only two minutes long. And I actually had a series of videos that I sent out in this particular promotion on separate emails. Now they had different topics. Now I actually did a, another one of these promotions very, very recently where I only had one video. So I changed it up a little bit just to see if there was a difference in me making many videos and just making one. And to be quite honest, there wasn't really. So I'll probably just stick, stick to the one because it's easier in the future. But this is the introduction video now very very simple page as i said you got the obviously date and time of the actual workshop or webinar up here a little bit of information there now this is congruent with the actual page that you go over to so when you go to the registration page this is what it looks like so you see here this actual headline is very similar to the one i had and you'll see here this is a very very simple headline that i've taken and put it on my own hype page and this is what you need to do when you're ever promoting anything like this. Take the inspiration from the actual registration page or the sales page of the product that you're actually promoting. Don't try and reinvent the wheel. These guys have gone through and they've used very, very good copywriters to come up with a lot of the information on their pages. So you just need to kind of use it as inspiration and cut and paste a certain amount of it over to your own pages to make your life a lot easier. So that's one big tip here. Make sure you're looking at things like the sales pages or in this case, the registration page to get inspiration. So this is a very, very simple registration page. There's a bit video there from Philip telling you about the product and then you go ahead and register. And actually the next one is now in the 4th of January, 2021, where I'll be doing this again. So that's the actual page that you'll go over to. And this is obviously the button they use to go ahead and register for that particular workshop. So this is the one version of the page that I had. Now I wanted to show you a different version of this because I like the one I did more recently a little bit better and I'm gonna show you why. If you first come over to this page, you can only see half of my image and the video image and you can't really see the button if you're looking at this on desktop. Now if I come to the actual latest version of this, this is the latest version that I did slightly later on. And this is a lot better to me because it shows you pretty much the same information, but it's a lot more squashed and you can see the video and the button in one view. Now this helps people because you need to make it as easy as possible for people to come along and click on your buttons, right? You don't want to hide them down the bottom of a page. So whenever you're designing one of these, whatever page builder you have, try and make sure that the main information is kind of in the top of the folder, as we call it, so that people can very, very easily click on the information that you want. Because not a lot of people will scroll down and start looking at all the information. Because remember, this isn't some kind of review page or a sales page where you've got lots and lots of information about bonuses and all of that. All of this is a very, very quick page you put together that you can house your video on it. Now the video is all about the product itself, more information, getting people hyped up, getting people used to what the actual product is, what kind of bonuses are you gonna offer, how much is the product, all that kind of thing. You can give them in their hype page during your promotion but the page itself needs to be very, very simple. So guys, thanks for watching. Now, again, if you haven't watched the other videos in this series, it is gonna be a good idea for you to go back and watch them from the first one, as you'll really understand where this hype page is fitting in. In the next video, I'm gonna give you a, my promotion review, which is gonna discuss various aspects of this promotion, the kind of things I could probably do a little bit better next time we do it, and then some of the things that I think work really well, then hopefully you can use some of this in your own promotions and really understand how you can go about and use this type of format to promote any of your products or services online. So guys, my name is Richard Darby. This is the School of Nomads. If you haven't been over to the channel before, please go ahead, hit the subscribe and notification bell, and I'll let you know whenever I release new videos. And guys, if you are looking to build a long-term sustainable business online, go ahead and check out the link in the description below over to the School of Nomads, and I'll take you through the whole process step by step. Now, until next time, guys, take care.